Okay, I'm feeling a bit like Scylla Black at the moment. Oh yes, it's time to catch up with two former housemates responsible for one of the most intriguing love stories in recent Big Brother years. Here to tell us all about their blossoming romance, please welcome Charlie and Dexter. Yeah. So, so is it all official? You can answer that. <laughs> Why are you letting Dexter answer it? Um, because it's still, as usual, surprise, surprise, Ironically, <laughs> um, it's, up, it's up in the air. Why? Um, no, we're just. There's uh, a bit of distance between you, I'm noticing. Come on, then, Dex. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, what's going on? Well, we're in the house and we made a deal and said once we've watched the show back, yeah. that what we deal can. Do we make? About going out for oh. dinner. Yeah. So we said, whoever won, because she said, I don't trust you, and if I yeah. find out that you're... We did watch that Dexter yeah. for nine weeks. <laughs> Full of BS, then basically you have to buy me dinner. And yeah. then I said, if you find out my feelings are true, then I buy you dinner. Yeah. What actually happened was something totally different. We went out for dinner, and she didn't pay, I guess didn't pay. Guess who arrived? Who? It was me, Dexter, and his mum. Triple... Oh. Yeah. The three of us. Okay. And neither of us pay for dinner, Dexter's mum pay for dinner. Yeah. But what has that got to do with your romance? <laughs> well, so, <laughs> we had lovely dinner, nice food. You had scallops, I had a nice bit of fillet steak. Dexter, I don't want to know so what you checking, ate. I so want to know what's checking. happening with the two of you. We had a few drinks and went out to a certain nightclub and yeah. we came out had and had a little bit of fun. Yeah. And that's it. Basically. We're trying to see each other, like, obviously, we're both quite busy, but we're trying to fit a time to see each other, and it's very different outside the house to inside. Obviously, now I'm not constantly questioning if he's playing a game because we're not in the house anymore, so... OK. So now it's just kind of about spending time together, enjoying each other, okay. and... Um, because you did fun. say in the house that you weren't attracted to him. Did. So now you've come out of the house, are things I different? Did. Um, yeah, they are a little bit, they are, because in the house, I still was attracted to Dexter. There were certain parts about him that... I found warm, and when he was not playing a game, I thought he was cute. And sometimes when he looked at me, I thought he was very loving and endearing. It was just all the other times that he was game playing. But now I've seen more of that side of him outside the house. He's sort of more real and more open and honest, which is what I kind of wanted to see. And I've okay. seen much more of that now that he's not... Um... So you still... You're, you, you had a cheeky snog and you got papped holding hands, but you're getting to know each other. You're dating. Yeah, yeah we're I mean, having fun. We're, it's we're enjoying really hard, ourselves. It's really hard to date in normal situations, mm. let alone when you're a little bit known. I mean, I know everyone's going to probably forget well, about us in a couple <laughs> of weeks' time. But it's... And then all the fans obviously really want us to get together, but we need, really need to get to know each other first in a normal environment where mm. there's not all that intensity and secrets yeah, absolutely. and lies. Yeah, all the and, past behind us and then actually just like kind of start fresh. And then we can move forward. So you're dating? Yeah. That's yeah. what getting to know each other is, right? You're yeah. dating. We're dating. Okay. We're so hanging Dexter, out. We're let's hanging go out. back to when you went into the house. You had a girlfriend uh, called Charlotte, who was very lovely. She <clears> came. On, her name is Charlotte, right? Yeah. Yeah. She came on the show. She was there um, the last time you faced eviction, I think, before the final. She was there with your mum. So, what happened to Charlotte? Me and Charlotte are very, very good friends, and I've been on the phone to her last couple of days. She's just happy that I'm happy. And that's what she said to me. Very understanding. Okay. So she's the most understanding <laughs> girl. <laughs> yeah. Dexter looks totes a moche, actually. You've got shiny eyes right now, Dexter. Oh. Really? <laughs> like glistening. Um, now, we all know that there was uh, a third person in your triangle. And that is Callum. Mm -hmm. uh, Charlie, have you spoken to Callum since? Actually, I have not heard one single word from Callum since I left the house. Not, not one word. No, no tweets, no nothing. Do you think that's because of your friendship with Dexter? Yeah, it probably is something to do with that. Um, yeah, no, we haven't even spoken. It, it'd be nice to bump into him, maybe, but... Um, yeah, I think it's very much to do with Dexter and I's situation. But you've had a little bit of a Twitter argy-bargy with him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's all Just that about, bit. Dexter? Well, it's... It's half banter, but I watched the show back and I looked, I looked at his exit interview and he spent most of it talking about me. I looked at some of the diary rooms where he was just so really strange. Like, How do you feel about him now, then? Absolutely hate the man. <gasps> <laughs> I mean, okay. He's actually Check. obsessed with me. Really, really, really he's obsessed convinced. with well, me. Well, do you know what? We can find out if he's obsessed with you because what you didn't know is that Callum's actually here. And no! he is <laughs> Joining the 
Emma Willett show, which it's now called. Um, so, so what? what it are your really thoughts? is surprise, surprise. It what? is. <laughs> Ta -da, ta -da. What are your thoughts on all of this? What you got? What you got to say? It's really got nothing to do with me. Yeah. Do you know what? If if they're now a couple, then good luck to them. Yeah, Dexter. We need it. Thank you for that. And we have been exchanging tweets and inboxes and stuff, haven't we? So, Very interesting, yeah. you know. <laughs> hold on, hold on. What, does, what do you mean by, by exchanging inboxes? Uh, you know, things are going really good for me right now. And um, I'm not sure in his tweet why my name even came up, to be honest. You'll have to ask him. So why did his name come up in your... What was a tweet? Because I didn't see it. I'm, I'm not sure. Look, it was, it was a joke. I, I'm going to buy a chihuahua and I asked my... <laughs> I know, I know, I know. Um, I asked my Twitter followers, what should I call it? Mm -hmm. And loads of names came up and someone said Murphy, because I like Murphy, you know, the guy that we named the diary room in the house. And then somebody said Callum. So I said to one of my Twitter followers, oh no, it's definitely not going to be Callum, but I'm sure he'll be outside Pets or Us queuing up in a tent to buy the dog before I do. Is this a dog you were buying or the two of you were buying? No, just, it's just Dexter. It's a oh, personal right. dog. We're not on joint dogs <laughs> yet. I was going to say, maybe, okay. not, maybe in a couple um, of months. No, um, no, now, Callum, you told the researchers that you weren't sure if you bought this relationship. Well, what I said Show was... Showmance or romance, mm, do you no, think? No, what I said was, um, I really don't know. Um, do you know what? I'm completely removed from it. What do you guys think? Yeah, it's real. Real? Yeah. Unsure? Because yeah. I don't know. <laughs> not sure, I'm worried either. Uh, Dexter, what do you think to the people that think this isn't genuine? Well, look, you have to give us a chance. Like I said, it's hard enough to date in the normal world, let alone after you've come out of the show. We didn't do a showmance in the show, so why would we, why would we do a showmance outside of the show? Well, because of cha-ching. No. <laughs> good point. Good point. That's a good point. You, you, say, you, say, yeah. you say, why would you? But there are reasons. I'm not saying that... Oh, hold on, I'm not saying that you are. I'm not saying that you are at all. <laughs> Let's be what completely I'm honest, is, Emma. There, are more, there, is, there is a reason for you to do it if you wanted to. That's all I'm saying. No, I'm not I, understand, saying you are. I understand exactly what you're saying, but let's be completely honest. Nobody wants to see my chicken wing arms on the front cover, cover of OK. I'd quite like to see that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> OK, that's all we've got time for. Guys, thank you so much for taking part. Pleasure. Thank you. Thank you. to continue and get to know each other in a private surroundings and that, that everything is good. Uh, still to come, we've got our DNA results of Ryan's paternity test. Rylan, rather, not Ryan. Uh, and we'll be finding out about AJ's past as a stripper.